She's pregnant. I'm gonna kill a pregnant woman. I found another way of putting the guy on the shredder or at least make it blow up when he goes against it. The only thing you need is simply your hoe. You just need to put your hoe exactly as it is right now. I really wanted to use it, but you know, not blowing it up. I wanted to use it so that he actually gets in it and gets all sliced. I would love to see blood. Not my blood, but the guy's blood, the baby blood, which we don't see that often. Especially when you're playing on this guy's side. Imagine if you could play as the killer. Dude, I might just have had a great idea over there. I think there's a way to prevent him from turning down the power. Now, if you notice, the lid is always open. If you turn on the machine, it was already on, by the way. And now if you use the lid, like so, I am not entirely sure. So let's drop it over here, maybe a little bit more to the left, like so. And this should be enough to blow up the guy with the slicer with the shredder. Use the records! If you pick them up and drop them over here... You can even have music into the game. Which is amazing. Well, not this kind of music though. Can we have another one? Like this? This also sounds terrible. I know there's at least a rock music that I've seen on another video. Someone playing it out. This is the first hit. Let's bring, let's see. No, let's bring the doggy. Let's bring Scooby-Doo. We want to save Scooby-Doo. As you might remember, that is one of our objectives. Keeping everyone alive, even Scooby-Doo. So I'm gonna drop Scooby-Doo over here. He should be safe. Oh my god. He almost fell from the box. Alright, so second hit would be the Shredder. It's still on because he didn't shut off the power. So if he shuts off the power, you need to go there, turn on the power again. And you need to turn on the shredder again. So let's bring Edward over here. Let's also bring the axe. Why not? Maybe because we want to prevent the lumberjack to pick up these axe. But oh well. Screw it. YOLO. I'm gonna leave the axe over here. And I'm ready to go with the grappling hook. Bilbo. Where, 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 where is... Oh, there we go. We're gonna watch this now. We're gonna watch this. Carefully. <laughs> but he's still alive. And he didn't- he didn't pick up the flashlight now. You know what? Fine, I'm gonna take the flashlight out of you. And I'm gonna use it for no purpose at all. I'm gonna maybe leave it here. Why not? And let's hide behind the tree again. Now! Now is the time for Bilbo to bring up the guitar. And stun him over here. While Edward, with the rooster sign, will knock him down. I have a song to play for ya. It's called... The death song. At least for you. Here we go. Bam, he's over there. Edward, do your thing. Let's watch this in slow motion. Matrix style. Please be faster. Please be much faster. Wait, what the? Are you kidding me? How that didn't hit him. Dude. Even if it is just a game bug. Even if it is just a game bug, it's important because now that is a way that I cannot use anymore. Was it because I was in the character select thing? I'm pretty sure it hit him. We still have the motorcycle and now because you guys suggested it, I have I had no idea. You can use a motorcycle to blow up the guy. Now this guy has... This guy must be in safety because the lumberjack will show up. So let's bring him over here. Where is the baby? The baby should be around here. We still have the gasoline. Let's not forget about that. That is another way of kicking the guy's nuts. So I have no idea where he is at. But uh, I guess we could go with the motorcycle now. And you can jump out of the motorcycle to save your character. And I guess that will be our next move. But... I think that does a lot of damage, and the baby doesn't need as much damage as he needed before. He just need probably one or two more hits. Oh, that! Oh my God, he has the hammer. He has the hammer. So I'm gonna go with the motorcycle. No! God dang it! Can can this still be the happy ending? If you know what I mean. 
Not in a sexual way, guys. Happy ending, as in... Can we still have the good ending in which they're all not hit? But you know what, guys? I'm gonna restart this. Screw it. I'm gonna restart this because that was certainly a game bug. It should have been hit by that sign. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, perfect position, kind of. Could be better though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go, got him. But that is still not enough, the guy is still moving. Let's drop Edward over here, because I'm not sure if the lumberjack will show up meanwhile. No, the guy's down. The guy's totally wrecked. And here's the lumberjack. It's me and you, mister. Now, let's try to find a good plan to kill this guy without getting my guys killed. So, hopefully he cannot get over here. We have two shotgun shells. That's what I'm gonna focus on. Ah, this is cool. I like that. Baby destroyed the door so we can already come over here and pick up the shotgun. There we go. Come on, pick up the... Wait a second. Is it already loaded with one? Oh, there we go, finally. Now, first hit will be with the shotgun. I'm gonna save the axe for the lady. And I'm gonna save these two shotgun shells for the lumberjack. Where is the guy? Suddenly, I got an axe into my face. It was the lumberjack with a ginger head. Oh, he's over there. All right, so I'm gonna wait for him down here. Then we can hide over on that tree. Then we're gonna need the axe, and the axe is all the way on the other side. Unless the hammer can also be used to break that box. There we go, first hit, done. And we should probably take this knife, oh my god. We should probably take this knife out of him. There we go. This is dangerous, I'm gonna throw this onto the water. Hopefully you will not come over here because I have no place to hide. Let's bring this over here. Lovely. At least he cannot damage us with a, with that. Can he? Can he do this? Great! Absolutely great. So let's pick up this shell. Now, some people say those are flares, and I'm pretty sure they are now, because I've used one the other time. But uh, you gotta use a flare gun with it. And I'm not entirely sure where is the flare gun. I never discovered, actually. It might be one of the last things I still need to find in this game. Come on, show up, Nugget. Ginger Nugget. Oh, there he is. He has the fire extinguisher. What the frack? There we go. He's down, but he's still trembling, which means he's still alive. So, we're gonna run him over. And that's gonna be right now. Let's see. Let's do this. I'm not sure how, how can you drop the motorcycle. Okay, I got it, I got it. It's just using the up key. There you go, he's gonna come over from that side. Let's do this. I love the sound, by the way. No! I guess I gotta be closer to him. At least he's not running that fast. Maybe because he was hit a couple times. I'm gonna safely come over here. There you go, perfect. Let's try to do this now. Where is he? We gotta be fast enough to drop from the motorcycle. He's coming now, he's coming now, he's coming now. Alright, let's gain some momentum. Here we go! No! No! <laughs> fast, 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 Edward. Fast, Edward. No, 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 no. Alright, that was not fast enough. That was not fast enough. He will still come over here. Oh my god, no! No, 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 no! No, no, that was very bad. Where, where are the matches? I still have the matches! Come over, you bastard. Come over, you bastard. He ran to the lake, right? And because the gas can has no gas at all, it didn't blow up. So that means I got an injured Edward, completely wasted gasoline, and just one hit on a guy. Just kill him. Just kill him. Take him out of his misery. But if he picks up... I'm gonna test this out, by the way. If he picks up the teddy bear, if I come over here, I can still hit him with the hammer, right? And damage him. No, no, no! 
Why the flashlight? And he got into the box. Normally, he can't do that. We will not have too much time, so let's do this. And then this. Then this. This. God dang it. I guess that was a good plan, but please survive, survive, Edward. Please survive, Edward. Are we still- No! Let's get out of here, let's get out of here. I think he was still hit by the explosion from the gasoline can. Let's save Edward and Scooby-Doo, like so. That didn't go as planned, exactly as planned, but I think this will work out if Edward survives this long swim to the other side. So that was two hits already. Let's go now with the rooster sign. You like this song, don't you? Alright, perfect. Edward, do your thing. Please hit him, please hit him. Yes! You hit him, so let's drop Edward over here and hide over here. Is he dead? He is dead. He is dead. I don't think I've ever been this happy seeing someone die in a video game. Alright, so the lumberjack will now come. So what we need to do is wait for him to go over to the left and bring the hoe to the shredder machine. And Maria is the one preparing that trap now. Maria, it's your time. Here he is. We're gonna carefully follow him. So we have the shredder machine and that will do a lot of damage, I would say. We have the shotgun shells. Is that enough to kill them? Or to kill this guy? Hope so. Okay, here he comes. He's gonna now see his baby. <laughs> ah, ah. Why are you crying? You're a man. You're the most manly man I've ever seen. With that ginger hair. Perfect hair. And that knife. He's really hangry now. Starts just, you know, crying a little bit. Like a man is still allowed to do so. Then he starts all burst crying. Okay, here we go. Let's prepare the hoe, putting it on the right place. So the shotgun is over there. There we go. Now we need to go get it. He still should be entering some houses, so he's still gonna take some time. Let's prepare the shotgun meanwhile. The shredder will be... Wait. The very first hit. This will be the second. And... Let's just head him out for safety measures, because I'm just bad. At games. So here we go. Wait, wait a second. He didn't get on the shredder. Why? Why didn't he trip on the shredder? At least let's. Oh no. He's gonna. He's gonna pick up the axe. He's gonna pick up the axe. Edward, will you be fine with this? That means not only this guy got the axe, but uh, he didn't get damaged by the shredder. What the heck, dude? So he just destroyed the, the hole? Is that it? Bam, this will be the first one. Maria is gonna do the vomit trap. That's how it's, um, it's gonna be called. Let's turn off the shredder, why not? We don't need it anymore, do we? It's not gonna be used anymore, I guess. So I'm gonna run over here. Wait a second, this is not a hiding place. This is the hiding place. There we go. And the spoiled meat is over on that house to the left. I'm gonna drop a lot of vomit around here so that he slips a lot of times. And I'm gonna make sure he doesn't reach the lake in time to save himself. Now, Edward. Edward should really get a weapon over here. Alright, so Jack, load up that thing called shotgun. There we go. And Maria, you're gonna set up your trap. Let's do that. We want the vomit right now to the right. So let's do that. Here's one. I guess this is still too close to the lake, but uh, as long as he slips twice, I think that's enough for him to die. And there we go. Now with the lamp, I'm gonna throw the lamp at him. He's gonna get on fire. I think he's, he doesn't follow you. If you enter a house, so I'm just gonna throw this lamp at him, and I'm gonna enter this house. And it will trip on that vomit. Hopefully, it will continue going straight, and it, it will not burn me. Let's just shoot him now. Because we have a shotgun shell that we can use. I have no idea where he is at, though. I'm not sure if he already entered this house. He didn't. He's over there. Let's shoot him. Like so. Beautiful. 
I should get that axe. I should get that axe for safety measures. There we go. Perfect. Please go to the right. Please go to the right. Yes! Burn, mother flower! Burn! Oh, he's still not dead. Can you please die? Please don't put... Don't... Don't... Please don't... Yes! Yes! He died in an awkward way. I see you sitting. That is that... Is that position. So let's get over here. Let's pick up the machete. And we're ready. We have everyone alive, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone, including Scooby-Doo. Alright, where is she? I'm ready. Come on, I'm gonna stab you in the back. Pretty sure he, she shows up near that totem. Right? Right? Am I right? If I'm right. Come on, we cannot, we cannot, we cannot lose this now. Even though I've did this like three times already, I'm still nervous. She is, she is. She's pregnant! I'm gonna kill a pregnant woman! Everyone's alive! I made it! Let's make babies! All of us! Wait a second, this is exactly the same ending. Dude! I survived with everyone, but this is... This is still the same ending. Did I need to have all of them in front of her? So that I would get a different ending. My name is Asparagini. Please like, comment, and subscribe. All the same, even though we didn't have anything really different. Other than giggles over my expressions and scary faces. And I'll see you on the next one. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye bye. Pretty sure that was the second time I said that. Thank you for watching everyone, if you are looking for more, feel free to check these suggestions. As a reminder, if you're looking into buying games, consider using my G2A ref link in the description of this video. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you on the next one, and remember, stay above the waters.